I'll meet to the G. I've been running on this beach for as far as I can remember. This is my beach. This is where I began. Now, 99% of the time when you hear those five words, this is where I began, you hear them from someone who actually reached success. The end made their dream come true. But not this time. Because this time you hear those five words from someone who accomplished nothing, but still won't quit. See, I accomplished nothing yet because I got unlucky, I got misfortunate, I got to be in the wrong places at the wrong times with the wrong mindset. I had to face the fact that I have a problem in my body that came as a disadvantage in the boxing ring. I got banged from country to country. I had to accept the fact that I can't even fight in my own country. I have best friends that I love like brothers who turned their backs on me. And I'm getting older and older. But all these obstacles are simply not enough to stop me. My moral of the story is, when you face obstacles, you need to keep in your mind that these obstacles are like fireballs coming to destroy your dream. Now do you choose to become a fire and roll over those fireballs or become a loser and let those fireballs roll over you? Your dream is like a very special jewel. You need to protect that jewel. Hold on to it real tight with all you got. Place it in the safe box. You do whatever you can do to keep it safe and never let it go. You got a lucky fight. You keep trying till you get lucky. You got to be in the wrong places at the wrong times. Well get back to the wrong places at the wrong times because as long as you're not quitting you are not Wrong. You think your age is catching up with you? Maybe you're too old for your dream? Well, there's a first time for everything. Why not be the first old champion, swimmer, runner, musician, actor, whatever it is? No, you have a dream, but you have a problem in your body. Maybe a disability or just something wrong. You have to fix it. But if you can't fix it and it's dragging you to the bottom, well, you shouldn't let that disability drag you to the bottom. Instead, you get yourself to the top and drag that disability up to the top with you. How's that for a dream? You can't keep going no more. But the moment you cross that point is the moment you become different than others. Don't think less of yourself because with your power as an individual, you can fly over the universe and the sky is not the limit. And when almost all of the odds are against you but you still believe in yourself, that is what defines the true power of self-belief.